This land is your land, this land is my land, from California to the New York Island, from the Redwood Forest to the... Good morning and welcome to Sunflower News. This is Drake and Tori reporting the news. Today is Friday, April 17, 2015. It is sea day. Corn dog nuggets, corn applesauce, and milk will be served for lunch today. It will be mostly cloudy with a 20% chance of rain this morning. The high will be 78 degrees today. The weekend looks rainy with the highs in the 60s. Miss, Mrs. Connor, Lydia Prothy, Landon Aquino, and Michaela Hendrickson will be celebrating their birthdays over the weekend. We hope you all have a very happy birthday. Mr. Johnson, Donovan's dad, and Mr. Osborne, Jet's dad, are our watchdogs today. Thank you for being here. We appreciate your help. The Earth is about 4.54 billion years old. It is home to more than 7 billion people and over 1,200,000 species of vertebrates, amphibians, birds, fish, mammals, and reptiles, and invertebrates, insects, mollusks, crustaceans, corals, and, other only, and others. Only about 2% of the water on Earth is fresh water. A recent study projected that the amount of solid waste generated globally will nearly double by 2025, going from 3.5 million tons of, to 6 million tons a day. Pollution and disease go hand in hand. In fact, about 40% of deaths around the world can be attributed to air, water, and soil pollution. Why are we giving you this overwhelming, overwhelming information? Because... Wednesday, April 22nd is Earth Day, and we need to think about the importance of this day and its message. Senator Gaylord Nelson founded Earth Day in 1970 after witnessing the destruction of a massive oil spill in Santa Barbara, California, in 1969. The first Earth Day led to the creation of the United States Environmental Protect Protection Agency and the passage of the Clean Air, Clean Water, and Endangered Species Act. Today, there are, over, there are more than 5,000 environmental groups in 184 countries trying to educate the public about global warming, clean energy, and earth preservation. What can you do? You can... Clean up the trash around your school or in your neighborhood. Plant trees or shrubs in your yard. Plant a garden or help Mr. Criddle in the Hope Garden. Recycle. Recycle tin cans, aluminum, newspaper, magazines, plastic, and glass. You'll have to take your glass to the recycle bins at the Lewisburg Cider Mill. Conserve water by taking showers and turning off the water when brushing your teeth. Bicycle or walk when possible. Turn off lights, fans, or TV when you leave the room. Instead of using harmful chemicals, steer your parents toward organic pesticides. Ask your parents to raise the thermostat in the summer and lower it by a few degrees in the winter. Encourage your parents to use reusable bags instead of plastic bags when grocery shopping. Remember, Earth Day isn't just April 22nd, it's every day. Unless someone like you cares a whole lot, nothing is going to get better. It's not. The Lorax. Please stand up. Please stand and face the flag while we say the Pledge of Allegiance. Place your right hand over your heart.